Hi everyone, it's Kronos and in this video I would like to be soloing the Omzia, Omzia, Osmia, Osmia expedition, the Hotmaster difficulty Osmia, using the Tinkerbell set. So let's go. And I haven't, I still haven't max limit broken it. It's still at two limit breaks. I've been too lazy to kill off all the A behemoths and all that and my ticket luck is bad as is as bad as ever. I think I used all the um what's it called? Oh okay, right there. I used all the tickets from the I used all the tickets from the tower defense thing and a little extra, like two hundred tickets ish. And I still haven't gotten an SS from the tickets yet. So, still unlucky with that. But, yeah, and still no light SS Maggie, so... That as well, so I'm using Lux Ladikium, or... I think that's what it was called, Lux Ladikium. But I want to charge up Vita Aegis before going in. Okay. So this expedition might take a bit longer than the other one because first of all o um, Osmia has Quadagus, so luckily it's not a rare. Okay, so when it is in that kind of pattern, because of the triangular shape, you always want to go to the one that only has um that has two routes, I guess you could say. If you go down and it went up there, then you would miss it if it decides to quickly move away. So, if I'm here, then I can go down. And if it isn't down, then I know that it's to the right. So, it's sort of like trapped. Whereas if I went down, down to, um, we'll see the numbers. If I went down to 22, it could have run away even further. So, okay, we found Osmia. And now almost 100% of, 99% of the time, it will put up quad. So I'll start by firing off the beam. So 16, 17k per tick, not bad. This attack, you just want to, okay, I failed the roll. You want, I was going to say, you want to roll as it like flaps its wings down. That's when you want to roll to dodge it. So roll. And then this, um thing spins around about twice and then I'll put up Vita Aegis real quick luckily okay dual blades cancel yes please so I've seen many people say this is so much easier with the light soul bow than the dual blades but I seriously can't use the um here I should fatigue it I seriously can't use the soul bow <laughs> like I actually can't so this attack again just roll okay that was a fail roll as it it's kind of it's pretty hard it's not just kind of it's pretty hard to roll when um it flaps its wings down ow 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 not nice not nice painful yes oh, it would really help if I max limit broke these things because like I, I would get a heal slot and I could put Quad Aegis instead of Vita. So the reason I'm using Vita now is because of the heal. Okay, so roll backwards. Like I don't know how you predict the way the beam will spin around and stuff, but roll backwards, I guess. You roll. You roll and you pray that... Damn it, I took the beam twice there. You roll, you pray that you don't get hit, I guess. And then now you have this cage attack. This will just slow you down too. And it will also trap you, so... I really don't know how you dodge, like, the first beam. Like, if you know, put it in the comment section, please, because it will help out a lot. And... I try this attack again. Okay, I dodged it, like... For, for me right now, it's like 50% luck. And this beam is good to fire at the weak. So once it does that charge attack, I think that's the best time to fire it off because you hit the weak marker, it staggers. And um, it staggers and um, what I was going to say something else. 
Yeah, and you always want to fire it off from behind because of the stagger. You'll, um, if it staggers back when you fire it from like a sideways direction, you'll miss like the rest of your beam, and it's obviously gonna put up a shield. I'll save my Vitaegus for the next time I take some more damage because then I can make more use of the heal. So you don't want to fire that that beam off at an angle. Or maybe I think I I think I worked out how you dodge that well. So you go boom. Oh okay, well that's great. Okay, this attack as well is also a good time to charge up your soul gauge, fire off your beam and stuff, because it will stay in the center middle. So from this angle. Eh, okay. Yeah, that's what I mean. You have to be pretty you have to be pretty ow. Pretty um right behind it. Oh sorry. Um boop. Cancel. And I'll just cut those messages out because Okay, okay. I guess um to dodge it. You just don't stand in the, um, the, when you see that attack, you'll see like the beam forming thingies. That, I think you just stand out of that thing. When I say that, I mean like, you see the beams forming, just, never mind, never mind. Pretend I said nothing. I guess I can use the Maggie a bit more for some damage. Okay, so sometimes it comes out from the beams directly sometimes it just completely comes out from somewhere else but the beams it's pretty decent like if you know when to fire it off then um timing wise you can get quite a bit of the beam in unlike with necroth okay that was a failed dodge especially if you hit the weak it staggers a bit so with Necroth, I don't think the weak thing came popped out, so um, it has less. T you have um, less time to fire off the beam because it has more time to get into its next attack. Uh, I'm doing a lot better than I thought I would. I just have to make sure that it doesn't. Um, I d first of all, I don't die, and second, it doesn't put up its quadagus up again. Hopefully, I can fatigue it soon as well. Roll that way, roll again, okay here I'm hoping to kill it, fire off the beam, hit the weak, okay yes! So yeah this was the Osmi expedition using Light Soul, not Light Soul, Tinkerbell, Tinkerbell can beat bad fairies yes. Well that was all for this video, I hope you guys enjoyed and up next the giveaway winners, S. Okay, so for the giveaway winners for the 150 gems, we had two. We have two winners. So the winners are Wilbert Lopez and Reaper Lord, or LRD. Typo. I'm not so sure, but yeah, congratulations, you two. Your gems will hopefully be in your gift boxes sometime next week. Well, um, yeah, that was all for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.